Hey guys, Rust Chance is doing a $3,000 Rust skin giveaway to 25 total winners. Check the link in the description to enter. Okay, there's a decent looking mainly all sheet metal base here. It has a vending machine or I guess like three of them, but they're all disabled. So there might have used to be a pretty decent shop here, but maybe it got sold out or something. Anyways, they're all red. Let's go ahead and jump right in there. Well, he's got corn, so it seems like this guy's active. And there's another base, oh my gosh. And there's another base with a door wide open. You gotta be kidding me. I doubt this thing's gonna be completely wide open like the past two have been. Weird triangle roof sticking through here. Anyways, I was looking at the top of this thing to possibly go in. And there's actually twig? And there's a hatch. There's twig door frames all around here. I swear we could collapse this thing if we destroyed all those. And a hatch right there. That'd be a pretty good entry point since it's next to the center. And the stone is actually decaying. So we could get right into there with this stone pretty cheap. All right, this stone isn't decaying, it seems like. Oh, it is a tiny bit. I wanna shoot this twig out and see if we can actually make the ceiling collapse. All right, I guess the ceiling is not gonna collapse. It's only 80% stable here. Go ahead and take this hatch. I do hear some turrets here, right underneath me. Okay, and I can actually get down, I think maybe past this hatch. And then into the middle, what the heck? This thing is so not secure. So I guess we'll bypass that hatch and just keep going here. We can get all the way to the first floor of this thing. This is foundations. Okay, here a bunch of vending machines right there. Let's go ahead and take that hatch, man. This is such a cheap raid. What is up with this design? Totally not secure. Ooh, there's a turrets. Um, I think those will actually shoot me. There's three of them right there in the center. So how can we take those out? I think they're on a half floor. There's a half floor above them right here. Meaning C4 will actually go through the ceiling. If not, we can do two more C4.
Yo, check that out, dude. It works. See? Because there's a half floor. I guess they get damaged through that. Bunch of random gear in there. Attachments. Bunch of LRs. This dude's looking pretty rich. 500 explosive ammo already. And there's TC. I just saw it in the corner of my eye. Let's go ahead and make this secure. There is a heli inbound. Um, it's going to be kind of tough to make this secure. Just have to completely honeycomb off all this crap. Alright, that should make it somewhat secure. I've honeycombed off basically that entire core. Just boxes spread everywhere. More LRs. I can't even take all these yet. MGL. 20 C4, 11 rockets in this small box. Plus more explosive ammo. Gonna set up my own auto turret just in case counter is able to get in here somehow. Dude is just stocked with LRs. Nine tech trash. That 20 C4 already got those gonna be so much profit. We barely use anything again. These bases I've been raiding just have been so unsecure. Look at all these vending machines. But they're all completely empty, I guess. Was he, what was he even selling? He wasn't selling anything in these. Okay, <laughs> what the heck? Another vending machine room with completely empty. Is this just an attempt at extra loot rooms or something? I don't understand. And another one. They're all just empty. All right, so I think I've checked all the boxes in here. Just have TC left. So let's check TC now. Already in the profit. Throw a box down. There we go. Let's go, 32K sulfur, 14,000 gunpowder. So after all that, we still got even more profit. Can't hardly fit anything else. Hopefully I can get out of here easily. All right. One of the strangest bases I've seen. Those turrets became absolutely useless if you know about the half floor trick for destroying them through the ceiling and it was decaying so I got in easy on the top and then there was no security around the hatches man I don't understand he spent so much time building these vending machine loot rooms didn't put anything in them and didn't even make the top of his base secure but hey I'll <laughs> I'm not complaining I'll keep taking it I love basically free stuff so I mean another great raid don't know where people are getting these ideas from for these bases, but I'll take this stuff every time. My 2x vanilla server opens up tomorrow. Ranks are selling out, so go to rustacademy.net to pick yours up before they all sell out. Thanks for watching, guys.